What's going on guys, Wilbo here, and today we're going to be talking about the most underrated gobble gum in Black Ops 3 Zombies. So this video is going to be a personal opinion type of video. If you don't agree or you don't like the gobble gum that I have chosen for today's video, be sure to comment down in the comment section which one you think is better or just a whole lot easier to use in Black Ops 3 Zombies. I want to know what you guys think about this and I want to know what you guys think about just this gobble gum in general. So before we get into it, I just want to say this is a personal opinion video. If you enjoy this video, want to see more like this, be sure to drop a like on it. Just shows you guys really support my videos. Let's aim for about like 30 likes on this video because I know that this gobble gum is very underrated and I needed to bring it to the public's eyes. So without further ado, let's get into it. So the gobble gum we're going to be talking about today is a classic. You get this gobble gum by leveling up, so this is why I thought I had to bring a video on it because it's nothing you get from like a liquid divinium or anything like that. It's a gobble gum for pretty much just playing the game. And this gobble gum is called Arsenal Accelerator. Now, it's a pretty cool name, I just thought I'd throw that out there, but what does it actually do? Now, to give you a basic description of it, what it does, it recharges your specialist weapon very fast. Cuts down the time by about a half, maybe a little bit more. It's pretty much speed collar in a gobble gum for your specialist weapon. So why do I like this gobble gum the most and why don't I choose either alchemical antithesis or any other gobble gum that may be a little bit more handy to use for the high rounds or just for a game in general. I could have chosen the danger closest gobble gum that pretty much gives you PhD in a gobble gum, but no, I'm choosing Arsenal Accelerator because of a few reasons. So this gobble gum works on every possible map we have in Black Ops 3 Zombies. It works on Shadows of Evil, The Giant, Derizen Drac, and Zetsubu no Shima. Now personally, I use this gobble gum on Zetsubu no Shima as it is the most effective. So in the gameplay, you're going to be seeing me using this gobble gum and I'm using it with the Skull of Non Subway. Now the Skull of Non Subway is a specialist weapon you can go and get by doing four rituals and you'll eventually obtain the weapon. And uh, the reload time without this gobble gum, it's pretty slow. You do have to get about 20 to maybe 30, depends on how many kills you get. You're gonna need a lot of kills just for this thing to be recharged. But with having this gobble gum, it cuts down the time. It pretty much just makes everything a whole lot easier and especially if you're using a very cool strategy that in the gameplay I'm going to be using today, I'm using the strategy itself, it's the Skull Room strategy. Pretty much you're training in the Skull of Non Subway Room where you go and obtain the Skull. This Gobble Gum helps 100% in that location. Now if you're wondering how can you make this Gobble Gum a little bit better when you want to recharge your Skull of Non Subway, because as you guys know, just recharging a specialist weapon in general will uh, take a while. It's going to take a while, it's going to take a decent amount of kills. And how do you want to get those kills as quick as possible, as easy as possible, and just as simple as possible in general? Now what I suggest getting is a weapon such as an SMG, such as the Vespa, VMP, any SMG would be handy. And you want to go and pack a bunch of that and possibly get either Deadwire or Blast Furnace on it. Now I prefer Deadwire as it does work the most effectively and the most fastest. It's pretty much just the best pack punch ability you can get in Black Ops 3 Zombies at this moment. So when you're training in the underground little skull area, you're gonna want to have this gobble gum, and you're also gonna need to have dead wire on SMG, and you're pretty much set for this thing to be recharged as quick as possible, pretty quick, and it's pretty much just gonna make your game go a lot faster. If you're using this strategy, if you're using this gobble gum, and if you're using dead wire, it's gonna take you like 10 rounds, it's gonna probably take you about 20 minutes. It's pretty simple and it's very fast. Without this gobble gum, you may go down by using the strategy, but just this gobble gum in general, it's so overpowered and it's a must have to have in any Black Ops 3 Zombies game. This does work on Derizen Drac the exact same way it would with the Skull of Non Subway on Zetsubu no Shima. It's gonna work with the DG4s, also known as the Gravity Spikes on Derizen Drac. So that's a little bit of a tip I could bring you guys today, just showing you that this gobble gum is pretty underrated. And you really got to put this on when you're going for high rounds or even if you're going for a game. This is really good for any easter egg you can possibly do in Black Ops 3 Zombies. And it's just an amazing gobble gum in general. So this is my personal opinion on what is the most underrated gobble gum that you can get in Black Ops 3 Zombies. I want to know what you guys think. Do you think this is a good gobble gum? Do you think it's not? I want to know if you guys know a better gobble gum that I could go and use and possibly make a few videos on it. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to drop a like on it 
comment. Thanks for all the support you've been giving me on my channel recently. Been having a lot of fun making these really cool videos and uh, you guys have been enjoying them 100%. So that's pretty much it guys. I'm going to be seeing you guys in the next one. Peace out and goodbye. Oh, 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 oh,